G'day BCM Tradies, my name's Jamie Gray and welcome to another Tough Test. And today we've got the awesome opportunity to test out the Pazload Straight Finish Nailer. Uh, this is a 16 to 14 gauge version and it's also got the capability of shooting both C brads and ND brads. So in your C brads, perfect for your day to day tasks like moulding, skirting boards, architraves. But when we swap over to the ND, the heavier applications, we can do things like uh, fix our fibre cement cladding, um, door jams, windows, reveals. Um, so it all around, pretty good gun. So why don't we try it out and we'll put it through its paces and check it out in a little bit more detail. So guys, today I thought we'd come at the test from a bit of a different angle, rather than just you know shooting in some marker trays or some skirting boards or just sort of showing you the general uses for the gun, I thought we'd come from a slightly different angle and really test out just how powerful this gun is. So I've got a range of different materials. We've got some hardwood decking. Uh, this is gonna be a really big test. Uh, we've got some FC, uh, we've got some mod wood, uh, we've got some yellow tongue, uh, we've got some hardwood uh, flooring. So yeah, this is gonna be a really good test. So I think some of these materials might be a little bit above and beyond, but um, it's gonna be a really good example just how good this gun is. So let's fire it up and we'll see how she goes. Okay guys, for our first test, we just got a nice little bit of lightweight cladding. Uh, this is just timber, so we shouldn't have any dramas with this one. We should just be able to punch straight through. No dramas there, that one was real easy, straightforward. Nice penetration with the brads, so let's um, up the ante a little bit and uh, maybe move on to some yellow tongue. So you can see there guys, absolutely no dramas with the yellow tongue. I think we're gonna need to really start to ramp it up and we might actually give the hardwood flooring a bit of a try. So, so guys, you can see here, we've got a nice little bit of black butt. So I'm gonna leave the C brads in for this one just to test exactly the kind of penetration power that we've got. So I'm not too sure how this one's gonna go, but uh, let's give it a crack. Wow, look at that. So again, perfect penetration. Uh, that's great. Absolutely no dramas shooting through that. So no, let's no. keep on ramping it up because we've got a few more thicker and harder sections to go that are really gonna test this gun out. So we've got a cool little section of mod wood here. Um, I haven't actually um, used a whole lot of this stuff, so I'm not exactly sure how hard it is, but I know that they warrant this stuff uh, for a really long time. So it's obviously wears very well, which means it's tough. So let's try and shoot a couple through and see how that one goes. Yep, no dramas. <laughs> this thing's going awesome. So last but not least, guys, we got some Inex Weatherboard, which is like a, a composite engineered product. Um, this stuff is like a tile almost. This stuff is super hard uh, and it's obviously, a, it's for cladding purposes, external cladding purposes. So this is gonna be a, a pretty solid test. Uh, this stuff looks like we've got a, a thickness of 16 mil. Um, so yeah, I've still got the sea brads in by the way. So let's have a go and see how we penetrate this. Okay, cool. So the first two have gone through okay. And then the third, has actually uh, buckled over and not gone through so well. But um, this is the exact kind of material that the NDs are designed for. So um, yeah, look, I'm pretty surprised that the Seabrads have gone through. Let's chuck in some NDs and we'll just see how good these bad boys are. So just to give you a little visual example of uh, the difference between the NDs versus the Seabrads, uh, the NDs, same length, 50 mil, but um, much thicker. Uh, much wider and a hell of a lot stronger. So let's uh, really put them to the test and we'll shoot through this Inex. Okay guys, so it's time to give the ND brads a bit of a run for their money and really test out the kind of heavyweight materials that this cool pads load can punch through. Uh, to change the nose attachments over, it's just a matter of flicking up the little bracket here. The nose attachment comes straight out. I've got the ND nose attachment here. We just slide straight through. There's a little horizontal pin that you sit on in here. We bring it forward over the little latch, push it down, and we're good to go. So we've finally arrived at the stage where it's time to truly test the Pazload Impulse Straight Bradder. The NDs are in, let's see how it goes through the Unix. Alrighty, there's six shots, and look at that. Six from six, straight through, absolutely 
no dramas whatsoever. We've absolutely smashed through that product there. So we could probably back that off a little bit, but um, in terms of power and strength, this NX is super tough and hasn't slowed the gun down at all. That's super impressive. So after that impressive performance, I don't think there's any denying the capability, power and performance of the Pazload Impulse Straight Bradder. So don't forget, next time you're in store, check one of these guys out. Thank you so much for tuning in for another BCM Tough Test. Stay safe on site and we'll catch you really soon.